Dear freshman me, life is really hard for you right now. I know it is. This is the hardest thing you've ever done and everything that could go wrong has. I know you miss your family and I know you want to quit, but I want to tell you about the next five years. Dear former me, I think that you'd be very happy to know that you have accomplished your dreams of becoming a Division I athlete. You have come such a long way from being an unconfident high schooler who was struggling with who you really were. Being a college athlete, you've learned to develop yourself as an independent young woman who continues to strive for success. Hi, I'm Katie. I'm on the swim and dive team. Uh, Eric Sita Silverman, men's tennis team. Hi, Thomas Wilson, men's rowing, and this is a letter to myself in 2019. Dear Sito, focus on the right things and put 100% effort. The results will come. Hey buddy, just a heads up, the next four years of your life are going to be unbelievably turbulent for reasons you can't even begin to imagine. Be yourself, embrace your voice, and don't be afraid to speak up. Your freshman year is one of the hardest years you've had to go through, but you start to figure it out. No, you're not a starter, but you become the best closer in the conference, and you love the pressure. Your teammates and coaches trust you, no matter what the situation is. You learn grit and resilience that year. After your freshman year, your pitching coach left, and you were really upset. But she was the one who taught you how to put your head down and work hard. I know in high school, it was easy to establish your identity in sports, but you have come to realize that athletics can do so much more for your life in many more ways than just simply playing sports. Don't compare yourself to others so much because everyone grows at their own pace and your time will come. Try not to stress so much about the outcomes of things. Learn to love the process for what it is. It's hard, tiring, but it's also fun and rewarding. Playing water polo at CSUN has taught you to be mentally stronger and you have developed connections with your teammates that have opened you up to so many different and new perspectives. You've gotten to experience so much more than you ever thought you would and you're able to think for yourself. I think you'd be very proud of the way that being a student athlete has shaped your life, and you've learned to find your voice and speak up for yourself. You've learned that your ideas can actually make an impact on others and that you have the ability to enhance college athletics. Keep rowing, don't skip the important classes, respect others, and more importantly, respect yourself. And finally, don't forget why you started and stayed with this sport. Remember that pitching coach you loved so much from your freshman year? She's a head coach now, and you commit to play for her. You're going to move back to California and closer to your family. But senior year starts different than every other year. You're gonna graduate early, but that means you have to stay at UTA for one more semester before you graduate, not on the team. You work harder than you've ever worked and you stay in shape. Every day you practice alone. But in that time, you learn to love the game of softball again. You go to therapy and you try to find your identity again because somewhere between being yelled at and standing up for others, you lost yourself. It was a weird semester, but you start to love the game again, and you learn how to be happy with yourself again. You move back across the country, start team practice and season, all within a little over a month. You learn forgiveness and how to trust yourself that year. Now it's your fifth year. You're tired and your body is a little worn out, but you love the game more than you have in a long time. You're finishing what you started, and there's nowhere, there's nothing you'd rather be doing. You're a little nervous for what will come next, but right now that's not important. You know who you are, you know what you stand for, you know who you play for, and you know you're right where you're supposed to be. I can't wait to see what we learn this year. Love, future me.